Yeah, I'm all for it. All right, good luck. Yep. I'll play this when it comes into play. I put another land in. Uh, tapped. I'm gonna oh. put this into play. Tapped. Neat. Go ahead. I'm playing Amulet Titan and Pioneer. Okay. I'm playing some random artifact deck. <laughs> oh, that's fair. Uh, Your turn. Yes. Yes. Uh, draw a card. Play a mountain. Uh oh. Play a map carrier. Block. Exile. Tip yep. card. And you're go. Good old mono rate. That's a good draw. I'll uh, play this. I'll play solve the equation. Go look for an instant sorcery. I'm gonna get. Okay. Solve the train. Go ahead. Okay. Bloop. Not the top, please. Draw a card. Thought about pump and pull some rocks in here. I don't think it's really necessary, but I thought it'd be cool with that. <laughs> and like pulsing, like bouncing something with auto wire or blowing it up with Boshaju yeah. and then picking the land back up seemed kind of cool. Right. Or picking up like a vizier. I'll play an island. Uh -huh. Tap both. Play. 1 3 flyer. Oh, different flyer. Yep. And I'll attack with the bonus. Block. And you're go. All right. Draw. I will cast Sylvan Scrying. All right. Go get Lotus Field. I'll play Lotus Field, sacrificing these two. Neat. Your turn. All right. Draw my card. I'll play Dark Steel. Mm -hmm. And put some scissors on some stuff. Yeah. I'll tap one to play a Mech Titan core. Oh, is that the thing that makes the token? It does. Nice. I'll tap another one to play another Mech Titan core. Nice. And I will attack with both these guys. All right, I'll block this one, take a while. You need a trigger. Okay. Right. Forgot. Yep. I almost thought I would move my dice for some reason. Oh. <laughs> and you go. All right. Hmm. How does this thing make the token? I have to exile four other artifact creatures or vehicles. Okay, gotcha. Cool. All right. So. Six, three, seven. Single first, I guess that's not the best. It doesn't do anything. Kind of does. All right, uh, land for turn. Okay. We're going to go four. Get my dice back. <laughs> Why'd you even put them away? I know. I know. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. And think. All right, so we got one green, and I'm just gonna say I have four mana. I'm gonna leave two blue floating. Okay. I'm gonna copy this. So now it two is Lotus Field. All right. I'm gonna spend the two blue. I'm gonna untap these two. Okay. And then I'm going to tap for three green. Play Ballad Get Recovery, targeting this. Okay. It's a regrow. Sure. So, I don't know how you want me to do this for the camera. The, um, I would like say put, put it a in the sleeve card. No, you can leave the, the placeholder card, but put that one in your graveyard. No, the placeholder. <laughs> okay, Just gotcha. in case you shuffle it, then there's not an unsleeved card. For sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah. I just didn't know for like yeah. the, the view purpose. This is the only checklist in the, the deck, yeah. so if you guys ever see this, it's literally this card only, FYI. All right, so I'm targeting this pickup head and strings. Okay. I'm going to tap for three blue. Leave one blue floating. I'm going to cast hit and strings. Untap these. We're going to tap uh, six uh, for six green. Uh, I'm going to leave one green floating. I'm going to cast Seasons Past. So I'm going to get one card of every mana cost. So this is my two, this is my three. Actually, no. I'm going to say this is my three, this is my two, and this is my zero. Okay. So these go back to my hand. And then this goes to the bottom. And then with the one green floating, I'm going to play a grazer, put this into play tapped. Go ahead. All right. 
a lot of stuff to do. <laughs> a land drop. <laughs> I'll draw. But it was an wait. extra land drop. Yeah. Draw and a black. <laughs> no more damage. <laughs> I'll play an island. island. Yep. I will tap an island to play Oct. Yep. Scry one. Yep, that is a card. Yeah. <laughs> I'll draw this card. Yep. And. Like I'm going to back blockers. Yeah, I'm just going to leave back two blockers. This goes to my grave. I think I'll. Oh, wait. Sorry. I was like, what do you mean, get rid of it? Alright, I'll just tap a red. Yeah. Play a gold hound. Yeah, I like you pulling one out. It's great. Yeah. Oh, it's a treasure. Cool. <laughs> and. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll just attack with these two. A block. Alright, and then I'll exile another card of that. And I'll uh, pass it on to you. Uh, three blue. Cast solve the equation. Look for an answer to source you put in my hand. Okay. I'm gonna get dark petition. I'm gonna shuffle in a minute. I'm gonna cast dark petition. Okay. So I look for any card put in my hand and then add three black. Sure. Okay. Then we will get this one. Three black. Okay. And then uh, I'm gonna attempt to shuffle again, but just in case. There you go. Uh, I'm gonna play a land for a turn. Uh, take two, go to 17. Use the three black. I'm gonna cast Mastermind's Acquisition. Go look for any card in my library, put it in my hand. Sure. Okay. I was hoping you'd pick your sideboard. I almost wanted to, but I can't this loop. I gotta do it the next loop. <laughs> it's too early. There's one card though, that in particular. Uh, go ahead. Okay. I'll untap everything then. I just don't know how relevant it is versus his yeah. Draw my card. I know what card I want in my heart of hearts. Cuts Yep. Yeah, I'll show you the card. <laughs> this is the one I wanted to get, <laughs> but not yet. <laughs> in my heart of hearts, he belongs in play. All right, well, I'll just play a mountain. Yep. And then that could be good versus board. <laughs> yeah, I'll just activate the ability of the Mech Titan using all my mana. All right, and then it's a 10-10 haste hexproof thing, or yeah, well, not hexproof. Okay. Let's see. Fly we'll Vigilant to Temple, Lifelink Haste. Uh, dun dun dun! Uh, he's our hero. And these are all exiled. These are gone forever. So this one. Oh, they're all just exiled forever? Well, the, the mech titan. Uh, the Bomat Courier cards are. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And wait, did this come back? Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Under there. Okay, so all these will come back eventually if this dies. Yep, gotcha, except gotcha. one of the cores. And I'll attack with the Mech Titan. Uh, they did their job. I'll take four. Okay. Go and to I'll go to 30. And this thing. Maybe I should use the blue dice. All right. All set? Yep. Cool. Funny. <laughs> There's a funny card. Oh no, that's what I drew. Like, oh, oh it's no. Very good versus tokens. Oh, okay. <laughs> tokens oh, no. in particular. But that's alright. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna do uh, two blue, or it's, it's gonna be three and three, but I'm gonna use one of each. I'm gonna cast hidden strings, untap these two. Okay. I'm going to tap for 
three green. Uh, using three, four, five, six. Cast seasons passed. So now I get one of each again. It's going to be my two drop. Uh, land. My five, my four, my one. And which do I want for my three? We'll say Bally get recovery for the three. And then this goes to the bottom. He's all right in my hand. Then we will. Four or five. I'm gonna cast Dark Petition. Uh, go get any card and then add three black. Uh, we will get. You can't. So the land has two more mana. It produces colors instead. There's a lot of spell player cast. Cost one more to cast. This card. We're gonna play an active room. Then we will. Uh, use a blue and one. We're going to cast hidden strings on tap. Uh, these two. Then we will spend uh, three mana, green and two. Okay. Cast belly, get recovery, picking up hidden strings. Same card. Then we will go six mana, three red, three blue. Cast this. Leaving one blue, one red floating. So the next spell I play, I copy twice. Okay. I'm going to cast Hidden Strings, copying it twice, targeting these two. No mana floating. So I'm going to untap with the first one. I'm going to make three blue, three red. Wherever red is. Three question mark, there it is. Uh, second one, I'm going to make three green, three black. And then the third one, I'll just leave untapped right now. All right. Then we will spend two black, a green, and a red. So four mana, wherever this is. I'm going to cast Mastermind's Acquisition, go get Seasons Passed. Sure. I'm going to loop it all over again. That's not it. I forgot to shuffle. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was at the bottom. Ha. Magic trick failed. Yep. Rip, rip, rip. <laughs> Successful. Did it. OK. So. Now, what I'm going to do is generate infinite mana right. by just replaying all these spells and doing the same stuff. So this is in the graveyard. And now I'm going to cast this for six, two, three, six. Pick up a four, or sorry, wrong one. Four, three, two, five, and a one. So then we will do, this goes on the bottom, six mana, uh, we're going to leave two black in the mana pool this time, so I have eight mana total, Okay. we're going to leave two and two, well yeah, because I got some six, so yeah, this is going to be two red, three black, three blue, we're going to leave two blue out of the eight. I'm going to cast this and then cast this again. So I'm going to make 18 more mana. I guess 12 more with these on tap. So we're going to say 6, 3, 3 and 3. And then these are on tap. And then I'm going to cast, I'll just do the start petition, do this, and 3. Go get Seasons Passed, get three black. That's the loop, and you've generated extra mana, correct? Yep. Yeah, so this is all my mana floating, and I'm just going to generate again. And then eventually, when I have a billion mana floating, I'm going to cast one of my tutors to go and get a fireball, which is this card. I'm going to use this to have oh. you take That's a billion. A lot of damage. Yes, and draw that many cards. Oh, I so I'll target you with both. 
Yes, no one ever has that many. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if only I put more cards in my deck. <laughs> you can always side up to 75. <laughs> I will allow you to. <laughs> so that's that. Okay. All right. Boom. Let's go deck. <laughs> like as soon as you demonstrate the loop, I'm like, you're done, Ray. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's like when you got the red card, you just go bananas because it's 18 mana versus 12. You can go off with 12 mana and generate one per turn, but when you're doing 18, you just yeah. go even bonkers. So. I'm a fan. I was going to keep going. Nope. <laughs> then it's like stalling or whatever. Like, isn't that against the rules if you've demonstrated uh, if I, a loop? And yeah, you but don't? as long as I don't, if I keep doing the same actions that change like libraries and stuff, it's not stalling technically because oh. I'm looking through my deck. But if I was doing like the same board state, like just swapping cards, gotcha. then that's stalling. But yeah. Yeah. Essentially, I could just break it at any time by getting another card. Like, oh, I'm going to play this card now. But yeah. Which you do to win. I do. I do. Eventually. Uh, this card's probably good, this card's probably good. This card's probably good. Might be overkill, but whatever. We'll do it, we'll do it. This card might be good. This deck's pretty wild. Is there any way to like stop that? Like with the counter or anything? Yeah, absolutely. If you like counter exactly se or seasons past. I see. It like stops, and then I have to like find other ways to like get it back in my hand, type thing. But you can definitely slow it down. Interesting. Actually, let me look at my side real quick. In comes this counter spell. <laughs> <laughs> a blue deck should have counter spells, to be fair. Yeah, I saw I grabbed that a little bit <laughs> too well there. I don't. Mm. I realized that after I said it, I was like, oh, uh. I don't know how I feel about that. I do want I don't think I actually have the right card for that. Seasons pass is like three mana, right? Six mana. Six mana. Actually, wait, then I'll grab the stainful stroke. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, how do you know? I was like, oh, this isn't gonna work. Card's pretty good. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, it's six mana. That's one of this card's worth it. I just need to draw this one card out of the hole. Did you pull anything from your sideboard game one? No, I didn't. Yeah, the only card I wanted was Nib Visit. So. Right. I'll just add this. I'm kind of torn on the Grixis list if I put one Fires of Invention in the sideboard or not. <laughs> or just four in the main deck. Uh, I mean, I like Fires. Fires are good. I own so many copies of Fires of Invention. <laughs> it's like a bulk rare and it's like yes. so good. <laughs> yes, like it's, a, it's going to like eventually go bananas. Yeah. Like every time I see him for ten cents, I'm like, I'll take ten. Mm-hmm. What memorial grazer? No. <laughs> I'll also take ten. Yeah, man. That's so good. I feel like this is probably bad, but we're gonna do it. Ooh, get two of them back. <laughs> Card's like okay, but I feel like it's gonna get outclassed very easily in your deck. So kind of ramps, but I also really hate that card. Every time I played it, it felt horrible, but every time someone played against me, it felt like yeah, banana. soul crushing. Yeah, it's the card that like, so the dude who I was talking to about this deck, I told him that that was the whole, I wanted to play a blue-red version of this, right? Because like the blue-red version uh, was something I tried doing before with, um, uh, before Underworld Breach came out, where it was just a ton of double casts. I played Ral, uh, Ral Storm Conduit and just like kill him with uh, going off with that. And it was specifically for Anger of the Gods, because I wanted to be able to play sweepers. And I couldn't figure out how to get Lotus Field without green. And then I played Wish. And that was kind of cool, but it's also very slow. So, not good. And then that yeah, went back to green, but I hate that card. I truly decided out so much. And he's like, no, it's like the best card in the deck. And I'm like, I get it, because like the games where you have it on turn one are bananas. But like... Yeah, drawing it late game. Yeah, like even on turn two. Yeah. Literally the first draw step of the game, you're just like, what is this deck? <laughs> it's just bad. So, not a fan, not a fan. But this card is like too important. If they ever like print a uh, map, it'd be better. I mean, just play Girl Spiral. So I tried it, but the fact that it has to be in your hand is kind of why. Because you know, I want to be able to like manipulate my deck more, so. so. I want instead of Grazer. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, I mean, that's fair. That's fair. It does draw cards, though. So that's always good. 
I think I'll keep this. Was oh wait, that's this. Yeah, the it's checklist just a, card. Yeah. Just doing this thing. And yes, if you're watching the video, it's perfectly legal how he wrote on the checklist card what he was playing. <laughs> yeah. That's the whole purpose of the checklist. Don't get me. <laughs> Don't at me, bro. They will. they will. They can try and find me. I almost deactivated all my accounts. Mainly just because I thought Magic was dead. <laughs> and the Twitter one was actually an accident. Because <laughs> okay. uh, like when you deactivate it for 30 days and you don't sign in, it just kills Deletes it. Deletes you? Yeah. Nice. And so I deactivated it for like 60 or 70 or whatever the days was, and I went to go sign in, and it was all gone. I was like, well, don't with Twitter. I'll just play a mountain and pass. Ooh, I'm alive. Let's go. Let's try. Bottom. Go ahead. Draw my card. I'll play... Play an island. Mm -hmm. Two two. Oh four. Oh, that's a good one. And I'll pass. Cheap. I'll just pick up this card. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go get Lotus Field. Go ahead. Okay. Draw my card. You should make everything retro. Not gonna lie. Keep the card. Agreed. One day. Only like crap ones. I'm okay with this too. I'll tap red to play Synthesizer. Yep. I'll exile the top card of my deck, play a mountain Ooh, from the top. Synergy, I love it. I love it. Let me just peek through. Yeah. No. And. Future side busted. Oops. I think I'll. Oh, wait. That would not work. I'll just tap a blue, play opt. Mm -hmm. Bottom. I will put this at the bottom of my deck. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. Oop. And then I will attack. Oh, I would attack. Send a message. And I can't block. You might play <laughs> that's true. That's you might true. play a hasty boy. <laughs> uh, like a top four, put one in my hand. Resolve. Okay. Okay. Uh, Tetsis. It's a random order, so you technically get it. Good. Okay. Noise. Yes. I'm going to draw 48 cards this turn. Go ahead. All right. Draw my card. I'll... Actually, let me look at the top card. I'll play an island. Mm -hmm. Play in Soul Artifact. Aha! Uh -huh. Yep. And that's a big one. I'll play Opt. Yep. Um, and I will play a 1 1 haste. Gold Hound. Mm -hmm. No haste, but. I gotcha, I gotcha. And let me just peek this card. That is a card. I will attack with the 5-5, five, five and well, this is can't attack, so just a 5-5. Five, five. Just 5. All right, 15. Boop. And your go. All right. Uh, play this. Tap for three blue, leave one blue floating. I'm going to cycle Vizier, untap this, draw card. I'm going to tap to go to four blue. Spend two of it, copy your Lotus Field. Spend the other two. I'm going to cast Hidden Strings, untap these two. I'm going to tap for six black, and, or I guess three and three. I'm going to use five of it, leaving one blue floating. I'm going to cast Dark Petition, go look for any card and add three black. I'm going to get past the barrel and cast it. Okay. Destroy all two of this. That is all my cards. Yay. And. I guess that exiles the top card of my deck. Cutscenes. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And then. Your turn. Okay. You draw my card. Yep. I'll 
play a mountain, tap a mountain, play a gold hound. Okay. And. Yeah, I think I'll pass. Okay. Uh, one blue floaty, cast shimmer. Top four, put one in my hand. Uh, this one. Cutsies. Oh, cut. No, no, the, oh. the three. Okay, but never yeah. mind. Uh, okay, I wasn't sure if you were putting that down. No, no. Uh, let's go. Go to four blue. Uh, spend two more blue. Okay, shimmer. Do the same thing. Good? Yep. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll... Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So um, I, I could pick the order that those go on the bottom? You could, yeah. I see. Well, you yeah. could cut them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. Cut. Yeah, because the, the bottom three have to be randomized. Right. So he's yeah. offering the cut. I see. Okay, I wasn't sure what was No, going sorry. On. Yeah, yeah. It's every time it has to be in a random order. So I offer that seems random turn. enough. Uh, use a two blue and three. Cast solve the equation. Go look for an instant sorcery. Okay. All right. I'm going to get seasons passed. Put it in my hand. You have just full stroke in your hand. That's unfortunate for me. You look at your hand. That's That's really bad. All right, now I know how to play it. Yet. Go ahead. <laughs> playing poker. Yeah. <laughs> Draw a card. It's unfortunate. <laughs> All right. Well, I usually just put the lands I'm going to use off for the disable stroke off to the side and never touch them. Again. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a trap card. Like shit, I only have three mana. No, you have five. No, I only have three mana. <laughs> right. I remember back in like blue white days, I would always like put a card over him, like that's a counter spell, and then like they would always play around. Play it. into it. Yeah. Oh no, it'd be like a wrath oh. or something usually. And then they would always play around it, and then finally, like when I'm hellbent, they're like, "It's counterspell." I'm like, "No, it's actually supreme verdict." I'm really sorry. <laughs> ginger brute, and yep. I'm playing Insoul on the okay. ginger brute. That's fine. And I'll attack for six damage. Take it. I'm at nine. And I will pass. Pretty good. All right. How do I beat this thing? Let's try. Start by beating the board and just play forever. All right. Uh, leave one green floating. Cast okay, summon spray. All right. Go get a land. I'm gonna get blasto. It's just so beautiful. I didn't even know. Top card. This comes into play. Play it for turn. Okay. And I'm going to. I'm gonna tap three mana, sacrifice by zone, destroy one drops. Okay. Then these will get destroyed. Then I'm gonna use the green floating and a blue, cast shimmer. Alright. Tap four. Take this one. Go. Oh no, it's fine. Alright, go ahead. Draw my card. Well, I'll pass. I'm ready. Draw. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see if you have it. Cast season's passed. I do not have it. Oh, no. I was ready for it this time. All right. So this results? Yep. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, we'll go with zero, actually. We'll go with zero. Got no one drop. Two drop. Uh, three drop. And a five drop. Some redundance. Alright, put this on the bottom. Land for two. Choose two cards and then 
Uh, blue and colorless cycle on tap. Draw tap. Uh, one blue floating. Cast head and strings on tap these two. We'll do three red and three blue. Number three is that. I'm going to go to go to one red, so two and two. I'm going to cast head and strings targeting these, maintain party, copy it. Okay. All right. So first one, I'm going to make three black and three green. And the second one. I'm going to spend a green, a red, and a black. I'm going to battle again, pick up hidden strings. Okay. I'm going to make three red and three blue. Whatever this is. Put five. Target this. Tap, tap. <laughs> Sorry. Did I pay two? No, I don't think you cast a spell yet. I think you okay, added the mana yeah, from okay. tapping him. All right, gotcha. So I'm just going to move down one blue and then move down a green. Yeah, sorry. So three and one. That's why I was like, I think I just jumped ahead. All right, so this is what I have. And those lands are untapped. No, I just tapped them again. That's how I was adding the three or three blue. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. I think I just tapped the I lands. I think you tapped the lands because you were casting hidden strings oh, and then untapping oh, oh, them. Oh, 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 oh. So I think they're untapped okay. when you, yeah. Right. So we're going four, <laughs> and then I'm making three red. Okay, now I understand. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. So huh. spend one each. Yeah. So we'll go this way. Fill this up. Right. I literally just like. You just lost your train of thought somehow. Yeah. <laughs> bam. Yeah, so I, was I think like you're tapping because you, right. you recovered right. it and then you tapped the lands okay. and then. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. All right. now, now we're there. All right, now we're all here. Yeah, I was like looking at this in my hand. I was like, wait a minute, did I just skip ahead? All right, anywho. All right, back to regularly scheduled. I'm going <laughs> to cast our petition uh, for this and three. I'm going to go get Seasons Pass to make three black. And I assume it's okay. I wasn't sure at this point. <laughs> <laughs> wasn't sure at this point. Like, okay, what else could have happened? I will get this card called Seasons Pass. All right, I'm going to cast Seasons Pass. Using this and leaving you red. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. All right, so this is a loop. <laughs> so I'm going to get this, I'm going to get this, I'm going to get this for a six, I'm going to get uh, this for a three, and this for a zero. This goes on the bottom. So yeah, six, two, three, and see the pass. All right, back to square one. I'm gonna loop it all again. So six mana, uh, I have an extra two blue. I'm gonna cast this maintain party, copy. Untap, three, loop. Loop, untap. Then I'm gonna spend the green and the black and the red. Cast battle good, pick this up. Then I'm gonna make three blue and three red. We're back. I'm going to cast Head and Strings using a blue and a red. Now I'm at two and four. Untap. I'm going to cast Dark Petition. I'm going to get Seasons Passed. I'm going to cast Seasons Passed. Uh, this time for three. So we've six. demonstrated the loop. Yeah. So I'm going so to break, break the loop. Yeah. So now I'm going to make a million mana. Oh, yeah. And then I'm going to kill you. Yep, that is true. And does he have the counter spell? Oh, no. I just had these. Two. <laughs> I wish I had like, drawn yep, an I got, the, I got the disable yeah. stroke for that fair, explosion. At the million, I would still have these in my hand. Right. <laughs> so you could just do it again. Right. Yeah. <laughs> but maybe I didn't leave any mana floating. That's true. You <laughs> should. All, so going forward, if you're playing this deck, you should always leave like. Say infinite yeah. mana plus 12. <laughs> Say infinite plus 72 yeah. blue. <laughs> Just in case. 
Yeah. What if you need green mana? Still need green mana. I got 72 blue. <laughs> 72 blue can filter into at least 16. Green. Yeah. <laughs>